trash. He was <laughs> seated like tenth for no reason. <laughs> there was so much disrespect on him, and he just you know casually gets first from winner's side. Yeah, he beat a lot of good people like Grace and everything too. That was crazy actually. Yeah. But uh, yeah, uh, if we could speak about uh, Highland, I, uh, Highland or Hinley? I think it's Highland. I Highland. Highland. Yeah. yeah. Uh, really good young link player. Played Toon Link in the uh, previous game and also Cloud in the previous game too. Yeah, he's been playing all kinds of characters in Ultimate. Yeah, and he's yeah. mad good at this game. But people, people they're mad good. We got two of the Texas PR on the left, King right. K and Denty. Tell me about those guys. Uh, they're both HMO now. Denty like has been honorary for a while because he was just like the team dad. He would like drive us to Houston yeah. and, and like he would be the one to pack the car with all like the blankets and the pillows and the towels that we would never bring because we're children. <laughs> 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 and uh, King K as well. You know, so someone I'm a little closer to. Really talented Rob player. I think like between King K and Grayson, it's pretty easy to say, you know, Grayson has better results. But King K like definitely just plays a completely different game than, yeah. than Grayson does. I think Grayson has like this really like watertight advantage state that he just knows exactly what to do in every situation. King K more is like a neutral based, like out of shield player, like has some like crazy plays he'll go for all the time, these I, up smashes and side Bs. I feel like King K is like really good in just like the chaos of the matter, I feel like. Yeah. For sure. Because, like, there's definitely times where I see him drop dry oil, and, like, this look like a logical setup, and next thing you know, somebody's getting up smashed for no reason. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He, he knows a lot of, like, really just spur of the moment up smashes or, or side Bs. Really good at finding the kill sometimes. Well, this is going to be an interesting team. Uh, we're going to be seeing Ness, and I imagine Young Link versus Denti's Pokemon Trainer and uh, King K's Rob. Yeah. I don't know who Highland's been playing. I wish I could see it. Because um, I know he's, he has a Joker. Looks oh. like he has a Joker. Yeah, he's going to be playing it. So yeah. the interesting the di di dynamic here is that Joker can get like arson like stupid quick off on of Ness. Yeah, especially even outside of with Ness, just in doubles, counters just get way better. Yeah, because <laughs> because the only thing people are doing is swinging. So <laughs> that is actually like, true. <laughs> yeah, like counters just get a lot better, and if you just kind of strategically throw out Rebels card a few times, you can find yourself with Arsene a lot. Yeah, you might not be the best player here at uh, Shockwave, but in doubles you might as well be a god. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, but anyway, we're getting started to this matchup now. Everybody seems to be doing the dance in the corner, the dance of death, it seems like. Yeah, they were all in very scary spots, but they all make it back safely. Oh, accident hitting him with it, and King K doing a good job of comboing off of it as well. Yeah. I, I feel like in terms of power, the uh, the green team uh, is going to be the better team in general. You got yeah. two guys who are on the PR there, where uh, no disrespect to Highland, he's not on the PR. And um, Austin is like kind of like he's been fluctuating lately, so we should be able to see what he's able to do oh, here. But wow. Highland shutting me up immediately. Yeah, really, really good timing on that back air, catching the. Uh, sorry, the vine whip. Oh my gosh. There's so much Flare, nonsense. Flare Blitz going. just ending, and also if you didn't notice, uh, who died? Uh, Austin? Austin died. Yeah. Oh yeah. So um, King K jumped down and tanked the uh, PK Thunder too, so it was super Ooh. short. I like the team combo that they were going for there. Almost had it. All right, right now we're seeing a lot of the Zard out, which is surprising because he's only at 27%. It's not the percent you usually bring him out, but Zard is like so deadly. Yeah, and he only gets like a million times scarier in doubles where some of his laggier options just won't be getting punished as often. Goodness gracious. All right, once again, it's kind of a mix. Uh, King K trying to get his homeboy, homeboy out the corner. Yeah, I liked what I saw from Denti. He was just staying in the air. He uh, downbeat and then upbeat as Ivysaur just kind of to stall to wait for his teammate to help him. Okay, has him off stage, expecting a low recovery. All right, King K finally makes it back on stage of all that madness. Yeah, King K was like going for a reverse edge guard, didn't quite get it, and oh, that back air center stage is gonna be just launching him off the side. That's gracious, and now the stock advantage is finally in the blue team's favor. And as soon as I say that, Highland almost gets murdered for it too. Yeah, <laughs> I think that's something we'll be seeing a lot of is like uh, both King K and Denti play these characters. That can sometimes be, you know, pretty edge guardable. Like, yeah, you know, you can meme. Rob will make it back from every distance, but he has no hitbox. So, if you can go out there and challenge him, you know, it'll work out a lot of the time. That's absolutely true. My man's DI is absolutely phenomenal, by the way. Like, yeah. SIB hell would have killed me. Yeah, <laughs> I would have just died <laughs> off the top, I feel like. <laughs> but he, he actually did some really good corner DI. All right, finally killed off the top uh, with, the, of course, the Ivysaur, and then... Uh, now the Joker finally can kill. So we're down to uh, not even even stocks actually. King K is the one uh, kind of clutching out for his team as far as a uh, way it out. He might close it out against Austin uh, too. No jump. Okay, goes for the high recovery. Oh my gosh, really good coverage. Uh, Denty coming up with the Vine Whip. 
Goodness gracious, how they Austin, Austin just wants to make it back. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, please, please allow me to come back. He's just been holding left and pressing L this entire time, but he finally made it. Okay, all right. Gets the uh, down air. Does it get the up air afterwards? Back throw is not going to take it on this big old stage. Uh, oh, good great combo. Great teamwork, great teamwork. And that's what they needed to do to close out that stock, too. And now my man's down to his last. Uh, King K is, of course. Just because yeah. he had to borrow it, uh, Denti did. Uh, that's the main decider of this game, I feel like, will be King K holding onto a stock. And, well, if Austin's going to lose his at 100 at the ledge, then things are not going to look good. Yeah, my man had, like, near max rage, so the side B was definitely going to kill. Yeah, and a move like that with such high base knockback is rage only makes it better. Now, this is still Joker, one of the best characters in the game, but we won't be seeing any of that best character in the game when my man gets us smashed out of shield. Yeah, I mean, that back air is safe, but if he's not holding shield after, he's going to get hit. Right? Yeah. And that's what happens with a lot of, like, Jokers, too. Like, that's the thing I've noticed. Like, they hit your shield and immediately, like, whoo, spot dodge. Yeah, like, yeah. Like, sometimes you just got a whole shield, man. Right. Especially when you're behind them and they can't grab you. It's like, mm -hmm. you should probably just hold the shield. Unless, yeah. you're, unless you're going for some other movement. But... It's yeah. like, what can they do? They can't grab you out of shield. Right. Yeah, and most of the thing they're probably going to do is like do an action out of shield. So, most cases, you probably should hold shield in instance. But, I mean, I'm not talking bad about Highland. Highland did it, like, phenomenal. Like, his DI was really good. Um, and it was still down to the last stocks between the two. King K was at Dev's door, so I don't blame him going for him. Yeah, and he was getting some really good stuff going. Killing off stage with Arsene Bear at, like, 70 two or three times. <laughs> like, some pretty gross stuff. Ugh. I'm still not... It's been like several months. I'm still not used to like Debo coming out along with a uh, little Joker and just like taking yeah. everybody's lunch money. Yeah, it's really scary. It's really scary. I, I like where Joker is. I feel like people have been really quick to say like, oh, Joker's this, Joker's that, like nerf this. But I, I think he's in a fine spot. I think Arsene is like a frustrating thing to fight. Mm -hmm. Like it's, it's similar to how a little Mac is frustrating to fight, but also not broken in any way. Yeah. But yeah. I, I feel like Joker's broken, but like I, I get what you're saying. I feel like. Most of the top tiers that we have here are not necessarily healthy, but they are a great step up from what we had in Smash 4. Yeah, like we're far, far, far away from Smash 4 Bayo or even or even Smash 4 Cloud, honestly. <laughs> Smash 4 Rosalina. Uh, uh, anyway, uh, getting back to the set now. Uh, yeah. King K and Denti are up one since we don't have any scores available. Oh, actually, never mind. I lied. We're fancy over here. <laughs> oh, wow. I like it. I, I haven't seen that yet. They are the green team. But. All right. So let's see what happens here. This is uh, going to be the adaptation here. They feel like they didn't. They feel like it wasn't their fault that he lost out on this stage, so they're just running back. Yeah, and the beginning of this game has just been two little one v ones, and King K has eaten seventy eight percent from Austin's nest. How really did tough. he? This spot dodge granted the whole down smash for real? All yeah. Right. Did you know when you spot dodge and uh, spot dodge cancel an attack between the spot dodge and running out of an invincibility and your new attack coming out, you're vulnerable four frames. That's crazy. So if you're playing ZSS and you spot dodge a jab, you're vulnerable four frames. That's actually crazy. Actually. I don't know why spot dodge canceling exists. It kind of upsets me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I almost feel like it was a complete accident. Oh! oh okay. All right. Okay. Okay. <laughs> like, I was like, okay, yeah, pick him up and kill him. And then I was like, oh, wait, that's not your teammate. <laughs> yeah. Man, Highland was definitely looking to sacrifice uh, Austin for the soul stone there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He was extracting something. All right, right now, okay, the green team was looking like they were trying to, you know, stock tank for a good while. Yeah, they were at those juicy percents where, like, yeah, some some of these stronger... <laughs> oh, oh, my, my God! God. 76 post hit? 50, 76, 76 post hit! Jesus Christ! <laughs> <laughs> Yuck. But, I mean, that's just really good awareness, getting that reverse edge card with full rage. And, and that, that was looking favorable for the green team. They look like they might go to grand finals, like, almost undisputed. No game lost from them. King Day is playing incredibly well right now. I, I gotta be saying, he's gotta be the MVP for this team. No no offense to Denti, of course. Yeah, I feel like I haven't seen King Kane doubles a much, but he has some pretty strong doubles, like, skill set. He was able to stock tank as Rob, for that matter, a character that's, you know, pretty easy to kill sometimes. But, I'm, I'm so mad. Yeah. He just ran up and just side beat him. Yeah. All right, Highland. As much as I think you're a good player, I don't know if you can do all this. Yeah, I don't know if the best player in the world can do this, but I mean, we'll find out. The best player in the world would be playing this character, at least. <laughs> exactly. <yeah. laughs> so he's got one thing going for him. <laughs> oh yeah, he's in a uh, he's in a hard area right now. He is in he is in the zone. He's getting hit by a lot of different things. Okay, finally he's able to work his way out of the corner. Yeah, someone only took 34. I feel like I saw him took take more hits than that. Oh well, yeah, um, getting like a cute fair one conversion, but. You know, rudely interrupted by King K. Oh, okay. Okay. I'm surprised we didn't see the back though there. Yeah, it would have been like hard to time, but I, I, I guess I don't know. Okay, Ars is out. He's got his tag team partner out. 
Oh, wow. Oh, goodness gracious. You almost got murdered for that ledge drop, uh, I guess, forward there. They were trying to attempt. Okay, what is it? Okay, trying to do the up air. The good thing is, that, like, they can make these mistakes. They're up by, like, what, three stocks in total? Oh, is that, that killing? Okay. All right, Not I yet. But that uppy is very, very strong. And also has frame four armor, I believe. It's like yeah. a pretty good out of shield option. It's so disturbingly strong. Oh, is he dead? Yeah, he doesn't have a <laughs> Where are they going? <laughs> oh, my gosh. Jumping off with the with the fire and... Oh, is this best of five? I don't think this is best of five. I think this is the best of five. Is this is best, the best of, five? of five? Okay. This is this is best of five. They're going to game three. Wow, but Shockwave, wow, bro. Best of five doubles? Shock, Shockwave's going crazy. Hey, we only got 99 entrants. Don't worry about uh, yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> only 99 entrants. Yeah, and honestly, like, at a tournament of this scale, when you have this many setups, running best of five isn't too much of a difference, because, what, you're losing one setup for yeah. a little longer in the tournament. And I don't think they're worrying about it too much. But, I mean, I like it. I like, you know, being able to see more doubles action, doubles something that's kind of, you know, hit the sideline in ultimate, you know, maybe a little bit. I don't know. Never it, been the main yeah, thing. Yeah, it definitely kind of hit the sideline because you definitely couldn't do, like, the regular team combos because throws. Yeah. Now, people fly away when they get, like, they're like balloons, man. They just go flying out of there. Throws. Yeah, I mean, that that is what it's called, balloon knockback, because, yeah. what's it called? Before, where knockback was linear, you would just go the same speed the entire time. Now you go like most of your knockback in like an instant, and then the rest of your knockback is like kind of slower. That's why people fly so fast, even if they're being sent the same distance. You know, I'm not gonna lie. I like both of them. I like the uh, the linear knockback, and I like, of course, the uh, knockback in this game too. But yeah. uh, either way, let's get back to the set right now. Uh, King K and uh, Denti are not looking too hot. They're eating a lot of percentages, and uh, 53 and 85. But King K has shown that he's been able to live to like disturbing percentages. Yeah, and. It gets, it's really scary when your opponents are just living that long, especially someone like Rob who can just chuck out these scary hitboxes. Yeah, I mean, we normally don't say it, but Rob and Rage is looking kind of nasty. <laughs> yeah. Ooh! Oh my gosh. Intercepted. Oh, he <laughs> saved him! Oh, he does it again. Oh my gosh, he does it again, and then the Flare Blitz hitting Austin, and like the big explosion it makes just catching King K in the crossfire. Yeah, that was, unfor that was a very smart stuff from him, but that was unfortunate uh, altogether. Good yeah. save by uh, Austin to make sure his teammate lives. I mean, the, the side B works, but at what cost, right? His, his teammate <laughs> died for it. And as we say that, just answering back, Denti's so strong finding these kills, getting like a meaty up air at like 100 and just finding the up B also, you know, at 100 off stage. Nearly oh, even. These side Bs are a little bit dangerous. And Charizard has been in the corner, what seems like two gears now. Can yeah, I think finally he's just been out? off stage, like side being over and over, just hitting people. <laughs> <laughs> of course, it's been King K like at least twice, I want to say. Yeah. Like, oh, so, sorry, bro. Oh, oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Life as a heavy is rough. Yeah, still in disadvantage, too. King, uh, not King K. Denti has been added to, like, what, 130 percentage? Yeah. And almost dying to the up air. The next one will kill. Oh, wow. Such good edge guarding from King K. Dying for it, but, I mean, it was worth it. He was at some high percent, and Highland was at, like, 40 post hit. Yeah. A little bit worth it. All I had to do is take Austin stock, and as soon as oh I say it, oh my gosh, KK, <laughs> what are you doing out there? No, little boy, go back to school. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I feel like Austin and Highland have been winning more of this set. Like they've been in advantage for longer, but King K and Denti have just been so quick to answer back and find these stocks. Yeah, and I feel like that's got that's got to be definitely the way they're like. You're either really good at like just like advantage, or like you kill people almost immediately. Yeah, exactly. And I think that's kind of what Austin and Highland would need to be doing, because both Pokemon Trainer and, uh, what's it called, Rob, are two characters that have pretty poor disadvantage. And if they're able to keep finding these edge guards, that's really what's going to be the uh, decider. Yeah, I feel like KK hasn't been on the stage for a while, but he's definitely going to need that. Ooh! All right, down smash, back throw, won't kill him, of course. He gets the gyro hit when he needed it earlier. Okay, what, what's the conversion? Okay, just goes for the back throw. Oh, yeah, when he's off stage stuff. finding a PK Thunder as well as just an entire Joker, it's just really scary. Oh, guess the smash not gonna kill, especially with all this much rage. But yeah, just okay. Nice edge guard going out with the fair, not being afraid. Now here's the thing too: we're used to having like best of three doubles, yeah. so we're not really used to like this adaptation almost out of nowhere. It feels like. Yeah, and I mean, playing a best of five doubles is a lot of doubles. Yeah, <laughs> it's like I feel like. Fatigue is definitely kind of a thing. Is It's hard to play your best in doubles just because you're kind of just running around, throwing out attacks, doing this and that. And it just only gets harder the more Smash you have to play. Uh, 
Okay. Alright. So, yeah, like, as you brought up before, it's, like, really kind of hard to, like, so it's just kind of hard to condition people in this type of, like, doubles because there's so much chaos happening. Yeah. You kind of just have to react to everything on the fly and kind of, like, try to notice the small habits as much as you can. Yeah, but King K and Densi going to be on their first counter pick of uh, the set, taking them to FD. I, I like the pick. I think both of them benefit a lot from no platforms. And it can be hard for Joker or, uh, or Nesta land sometimes. Yeah, and also like Joker doesn't get the uh, the drag on up air and up smash, which you know. Yeah. Thank the Lord, that would kill like 90 on most characters. Yeah, it's a really scary confirm. Like I feel people knew about the combo for a while, but they were like, oh well, you're never gonna hit that in the match, and then we're just like, oh actually, it's not that hard. <laughs> <laughs> like everyone just thought that it was hard and just didn't do it, and then now it's starting to come out. Yeah, and then MK a little blew everybody's mind by six owing. Uh, tw was it tweak? Yeah, at, yeah, uh, yeah. You know, at Evo. Ooh, now I'll smash. Oh. Definitely gonna start. Might would possibly be a reverse 3 0. Oh, wow. Really good edge guarding. Oh, but he makes it back. And Austin finding in a, an up smash from NK. Yeah. I mean, it's not looking at the healthy percentages. Has him off stage, though. Oh, actually gets hit with the nair. Oh, tries oh to go gosh. for a dare on so him, too. So much is going on off stage right now. And as well as Kinkei, unfortunately, killing his teammate. Yeah, Austin almost repeating the same there, but luckily for them, uh, Highland still has. Good amount of rage on him, and just gets blown up as soon as I bring it up. Oh my gosh. Just stocks being answered left and right. I mean, all of these characters have some really explosive kill power. All of them have, like, some dumb aerial that they could just throw out and kill people with. <laughs> Pretty much. But Rob, it's a nice side B. As I bring it up, to, Not going to be killing him. Yeah. Good high recovery, but he's still in the blender? Okay, no. Okay. They all make it back to the hitch. They all, like, started running out of resources at the same time, and <laughs> they were just not being. <laughs> they were like, hey, guys, you want to call him? Truce, truce, truce. <laughs> okay, good recovery from Denti, realizing that he got hit with the uh, counter last time, but the back here not killing oh him still. God. Charizard is a one heavy dude. Yeah. Oh, wow. The Catching him all the way at the top of the screen with up air, but great DI from Austin making him back. Oh! What? Okay. <laughs> okay. So a few things happened there. <laughs> Denty was trying to side V, you know, someone, but King K just eats it, and then Austin grabs him and cancels all of the knockback. Yeah, and he just four throws him because he wasn't expecting all that madness to happen. Yeah. Oh, he's off oh, stage. Austin's in a scary spot, but yeah, Nessa's kind of silly air dodge, letting him make it back. All right, finally gets it with the forward air. Highland's the only one that's living to. Uh, that was a good break there from Austin because he needed that. Yeah. But up throw potentially probably would have killed him there. I'm not too sure. Yeah, but he makes it out. And this is where it gets scary. If Highland like, gets his second Arsene and starts running around, throwing out these terrifying aerials, that's where it, it could get bad for King K and Denti. Yeah, because... Oh, no, the gyro! Oh, he gets clipped. Okay, okay it makes okay. it back. Great recovery. All right, my man's trying to live. He's trying to avoid this. Okay, he finally gets past the Arsene. Thank God. Yeah, but... Not without taking a lot of percent, and Denti or King K could easily just lose their stock here, and that would probably be curtains for this game. Yeah, both well, these guys are heavy, but I mean, like, they can only take so much, so much hits. Yeah, that side B is not safe on shield, my friend. Yeah, that moves like negative a thousand, it feels like. Um, everyone, like, taking a break to all shield uh, <laughs> King K's laser. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, King K's by himself here. He has to eliminate Austin if he gets the chance. Joker's gonna close up the room really quick, though. Yeah. And. Joker's also at that percent where, uh, like, it'll be really tough for King K to even hit him away, but, yeah, that F smash cross stage is going to be killing him. All right, and this is the first time I've said this in a while. Grand, or not grand finals. Game five and doubles. Yeah, winner's finals. <laughs> winner's finals. Yeah, looks like King K and Denti made the biggest mistake they could. They they went up 2-0. <laughs> oh, yikes. That's, that's a big mistake. And, you know, while it is a joke, there's some truth to it, like, Winning that game five after going up 2-0 is so tough. Like you just lost two games in a row. Mm -hmm. You don't even you don't even remember what it's like to win. <laughs> yeah, it's just it's just tough. Morale is low, and like you're like okay, they're just answering everything. And like the thing with teams too is like sometimes teams can get like a little bit discouraging. Somebody could be on a team and be like, man, like I think they're starting to figure this out. Man, I don't know what's going on, what the answer is. And like you have to you have to personally speak to the person right next to you, be like, bro, all right, we got this, man. Calm down. Yeah, it's like we just won like three <laughs> games ago. That's it's fine. <laughs> but we'll be saying uh, their new counter pick. Maybe maybe they're gonna change it up. Maybe it won't, it won't be empty this time. All right, let's see what the answer is here. Battlefield. Battlefield. Interesting pick. Yeah, basically the the reverse of what they had last time. I'm not completely sure about this. I feel like 
something that really benefits them is they've been getting a lot of, uh, what's it called? A lot of mileage from Gimps. And Gimps work a lot better on this stage just because the blast zones are so big that you'll live to a really long percent. Mm -hmm. And uh, if you Gimp them, then they'll just die no matter what. It doesn't matter. It's also interesting, too. Yeah, because they've also been living a really high percentage. And the blast zones are really big on this stage, too. So, right. like, both the heavies will definitely... Uh, they're, they're, they're going to make some news ha happen here, I feel like. Yeah, they're going to put some numbers up. <laughs> <laughs> they're going to go into the deep scarlet. <laughs> but, yeah, they've just been trading hits back and forth. Oh. Nearly completely even percents right now. That was good coverage from Highland, too. Making sure that uh, Austin did not get punished for the, that uh, PK Thunder. Yeah. Ooh! Oh, and that's not what you like to see. And that is not a very high percent. Dying at, well, like, 130 posted to that back air. That was a good frame one switch by Denti. Because if he did not switch right there, he was dead. He already used his air dodge. And that was amazing counterplay from him. But uh, right now, he does still have to get rid of this uh, this Joker. Yeah. Because both these characters with Rage on the blue team is not great. Yeah, you don't like to see that, like a, a Rage Nest Bear just killing at the ledge at 80. <laughs> yeah, or even, uh, of course, you know, the magical PK Thunder. Yeah. That was good. He knew that he had to get up or, like, he was going to catch the uh, the switch out immediately because one of them would get Trump. Yeah, it's really awkward when you're... Um when you're recovering with your teammate and you end up trumping them. That's something that Zillion was telling me he's really good with is you could just chuck Thor on when they're both recovering and someone always gets hit. <laughs> <laughs> All right, right now, uh, Austin living to 163, almost killing with Rage back throw. Yeah, really scary. But wow, Uppy just killing off the top. and oh. Okay, finally getting his stock rid of, but not before taking out a lot of other players. Yeah. All right, Denti's in the corner versus this crazy Joker. Yeah, I mean, there are b four stocks on both sides, but, I mean, Denti, it, well, <laughs> yeah. now there's now there's three stocks on one side. Let's just say that. It's three stocks versus four stocks. It's not out of the realm of possibility, but they have to, like, I feel like they have to play better than they ever played before. Yeah. Because Austin and Highland do have momentum, of course, going from, like, what could potentially be a reverse 3-0. Yeah. I mean, if, <gasps> oh, Austin? that might just be what they need to make it back into this. Austin with a pretty uncharacteristic SD. I think he was just expecting to land on stage, but just held down and just fell all the way past the ledge. I think that, or like he like thought he had the jump. I'm not too sure, but uh, either way it is, that was unfortunate for him, but this might be the start of something special for him. Yeah. Okay, That's the kind of thing you really, that gives you a new lease on life when you're a King K and Denti here is like, as the deficit gets bigger and bigger and you're just starting to lose hope, but then the, the sparkle at the end of the <laughs> tunnel, you see it. <laughs> yeah. All right, gets the forward air. This is looking very scary because if both these two die at the same time, it's a one versus two situation. Yeah. For on the other side, like they can definitely uh, do the same thing exactly to this uh, this blue team. Yeah, but Highland's been holding on to this stock for a really long time. We're All seeing right. a restock. King K taking Denti's last one. Oh my goodness gracious! Austin there immediately saved his teammate. Very smart. Good awareness. Yeah, they're trying to set up an edge guard on Austin or on Highland. I'm sorry. And Austin was very quick to just, hey, break it up, boys. <laughs> I like the fact that uh, Denti's just keeping away from everybody here. All right, not going to be into the stock, but it's getting really close for Austin. Yeah, like Austin <gasps> or Highland. Oh, he actually had the, he actually had the read. <sighs> yeah. But like, unfortunately, the uh, the leap from Denti stopping that all from happening. Okay. Highland or Austin have to die here somehow. Like, they're hitting some crazy percents right now. And that's going to be death for Austin. Let's see if they kill Highland fast enough, though. Oh, my God. Oh, really good recovery from Denti. Denti playing out of his mind to recover. It's going to be him versus Austin, a classic that we have here at uh, Shockwave. we got big, nasty Charizard out here, too. Charizard got some hella buffs. Oh, wow. Not holding the flame breath long enough. And unfortunately, that platform getting in the way of his uh, falling there. And that neutral B is so good at resetting neutral. A really good tool. Okay, passing oh, a few hits and Zard can kill you out of nowhere. Yeah, sure. definitely. He's got little to no shield. Oh, he just goes for it. <laughs> okay. Oh my gosh. Yeah. That, that wouldn't have killed. <laughs> that honestly wouldn't have killed, even if it landed. But. No, no, it wouldn't have killed, but it would have broke the shield. Oh, it would have broke the shield. Oh, it would have yeah. broke the shield. Of course. Yeah. I think it was a little bit too ballsy of a play, personally, in my opinion. But like, I could definitely see like the, yeah. what was going on inside the head there. But yeah. first 3-0, unfortunate for Denti and King K. But those are the breaks for you, man.